And Brandon Bussey gets a starting goal for Providence tonight, who's been a rookie phenom so far. In the now Carrick, his shot blocked, rebound, chance got blocked to make it a legal play. Meanwhile, takeaway, Toporowski shoots and scores. Well, after all that, it ended up being a sloppy change. Much like last night, the Bruins capitalized. It's Luke Toporowski, who scored last night for the Bruins on the sloppy change, gets another one tonight. Into the middle, it's a deflected puck up in the air, and now a penalty up coming on Chris Wagner. Oh, and then a late shot by Wagner, and that draws a huge crowd. Walcott immediately came over and... Bunch have it right back. They retool in over the line, Fortier. Looking to the front, got it through, save, rebound, tipped on goal, a save by Bussy, and then he gets decked into the goaltender, and here we go. Browski's got one tonight, leaned on by Day, gets to the goal and scores, what a goal. Luke toporowski has got two goals tonight, three goals in two games in Syracuse, and he gives the Bruins a 2-0 lead. Wow. He just sped down the left wing, absorbed the defensive effort from Sean Day, Thompson down low, quick pass in the middle, a shot, score! Beautiful passing by the Crunch and Felix Robert on the power play. And the Crunch are on the board, it's 2-1 Bruins with 3.18 left in the first period. High point, Carlisle, his long shot, save, rebound, loose, pops up in the air. Walcott digging for it and a penalty upcoming. He bumped Brandon Bussey again. Didier comes over. Walcott getting called for that infraction and another crown forming in the crease. And Dumont, Reifers, Carrick, and Radish, the penalty killers to start period number two. Into the offensive zone with Brazo. Right wing side, centers, it goes off of Dumont and in. And Justin Brazo has three goals in two games this weekend for the Bruins. He'll get the fortunate bounce and Providence leads three to one. 3.20 gone by in the second period. Fling it behind for Gonsalves. Sets up Carrick, a shot! Oh, it was knocked down in front of the goal. He's got 48 to partial, two on O. Here's Reifers, pass out in front, tip and a save! Bussey's got it underneath him, a penalty on the way. And another push and a shove here after the whistle. It's Connor Carrick coming after Gabe Fortier. Lost though by the crunch. Here's McLaughlin, he scores! Mark McLaughlin rips one off the bar and in. And the Bruins capitalize four on four off a turnover by the Crunch, and it's 4-1 Bruins. Exactly five minutes to go in the second period. Herrick. Now gets it across, nice pass, a shot, score! Simon Reifers from the slot, and the Crunch get another late goal. This one in the second period, it's a 4-2 Providence lead. Down by two men. Vinny Letiri against Dumont. Dumont won the big face. They dig for possession. Here is a hard hit by Walcott off the near corner. McLaughlin is down. The gloves are dropped. And Walcott and Riley tumble to the ice. Haddish off his back end. Feeds it to the left. Here's Smith. Across. Usov one-timer score! A power play goal for Ilya Usov. And the cruncher within one. 13-27 left of the third. Zone into the offensive zone, Copenhagen slips it free. Out to the front, they score. It is a hat trick goal for Luke Toporowski and the Bruins quickly answer back and they lead five to three. With 12-27 left of the third period, a hat trick tonight for Luke Toporowski. Through, nice pass, Day steps and shoots, he scores! And here we go again, a post-goal scrum. Saw it last night, happening again tonight. And everyone getting involved along the far goal line. The officials are trying to, uh, I guess, maintain order, but that is long past. Up to the right point, Carrick turns it across. Thompson shoots, and they score! But they wave it off! The referee saying no goal, and he's indicating an interference on the goaltender against the crutch. Radish to Usov, one-timer save, rebound, chance, score! Robert has tied it! Knocked down by Legacy, and this game is headed to overtime. Wheels to his right, has a step, gets down low, will come in behind the goal, wrap attempt, score! Chris Wagner with a wraparound goal, and the Bruins prevail in overtime. A 6-5 victory, 3.47 left in OT.
And the wraparound by Wagner, his seventh goal of the season in Providence, wins both games here in Syracuse. 